<laughs> Where the hell's Lee gone? Where's Lee gone? Where's Lee? And that's the final challenge. After 96 miles. Oh, hey, which way are we going? Oh, that way. <laughs> <laughs> and we're lost already. Me, Drewfus, and Lee doing the West Island Way. Hope to do it in a week. And Ben Nevis at the end. It's a bird beer uh, eating dog pup. <laughs> Lee's down there retching it. <laughs> yeah, nice. The only thing about Scotland, you've got to pack for the cold weather. It's absolutely freezing here. Well, this is Jurassic Park, huh? Welcome to yeah, yeah, Jurassic yeah. Park. Where the dinosaurs are Easy jump. My birds, I do. Five miles in, seven to go. Started uh, cooling down a little bit. They knew what they were doing when they made nuts. Called the company Big D. Ah, uh, cool animals to see. To oh, thank you. Thank you very much. There's loads of signs here. Don't feed the ponies, it says. Trufus is on his second wind, yeah. He's we just cannot keep up with him. He's absolutely booting it, bruv. Oh, what's he found? Let's have a look. Oh, yes. Oh, we got an ice cream, are we? Cold can. We've been warned about this bit, this corrad, it's called Chronic Hill, this is. Stop, it's called Tronic Hill, then. Chronic Hill. <laughs> so that's Chronic Hill. There. We were planning to sleep on the top of it, but uh, there's a woods right next to it, so we're just going to see how close we can get tonight. Look for a campsite now. Some bogs everywhere. If it comes to it, we're going to pitch next to the path because we are allowed to camp around here. Um, I'm just going to try and press on for a bit. We've got about an hour of light. 20 past 8. We started at 1. Started at 1. We've done 7 hours. 15 miles. Whew. Can't find anywhere to camp yet. Now we've got a half hour left of light. About seven hours. Well, 1 o'clock we started, didn't we? Yeah, have a look. We've been walking for four hours and 58 minutes. <laughs> 15 We've miles and a half 15 time. miles and five, five hours. hours. Have a piece on. Food from the tent. Wow. Ah, Man, look at this sky. It's crazy. Cheers. I don't feel too stodged like. Yeah. 15 miles smashed out since dinner time. Picked a fantastic spot, yeah. Just found it in time before the sun's going down. Lee's new Z packs he stopped in Glasgow for. Literally bought it today. He's brought it out for the week. So I'm going to, I'm going to zip it. I'm going to zip, unfortunately. <laughs> it's knackered. It looks like it's going to be a good sunset tonight. Look at that. 
So it's lava coming up over the horizon. Roof is doing some essential checks, yeah? <laughs> Where the hell's Lee gone? Six o'clock in the morning, and Lee's gone. I don't know how long he's been gone. We're guessing that Zed Parks didn't work very good and he's gone to the local shop to buy a Van Gogh. That's the only thing we can think. Yesterday, we got a hell of a piece on. So we started about one o'clock in Mulgai. Come all the way, so this was a nice part through the country park. Got a little bit more boring then. Um, a lot of quite straight routes like that, nothing to see. But I don't know, it wasn't too bad. We came up here, the road walk in, went to Dryman. When we got there then, we decided instead of coming back up here, we followed the Rob Roy way. Picked up with it here and we are somewhere up here, I think, just before Connick Hill. It looks like we can resupply our water there now. And then onward, following the loch. Curry pot noodle for breakfast, just gone down. And now it's coffee time. Bit of a grim morning. I think Lee has ploughed on ahead just to uh, have a little bimble slowly. But we're doing the same thing today. We're not going to uh, push ourselves. <laughs> we might not catch up with them at this rate. <laughs> Needs to calm down, man. Calm down. My ears sticking up here. My ears sticking up this app. Right, Conic Hill, down on the Loch Lomond, and we're following that all day. We're just coming up Chronic Hill now. It's steeped in mystery. Some say the first time Snoop Dogg visited, he toked his holy smoke. It's been covered in mist ever since. Welcome to the most walked hill in Scotland. Look at the repair job we've had to do on this. Right, you're good riding on the bike? Oh, you know why, good. <laughs> yeah, it should be doable, man. Stunning. Now, this is uh, Tom Weir, Scotland's most loved mountain man, apparently. The rare young man. Yeah. What an amazing spot these guys are. Oh. I can't even see the end of the lock. One of them islands out there is full of wallabies. Yeah, I thought you said koalas, see that I said. Ah, right. The koalas have got chlamydia, right? They're the ones with chlamydia, are they? Yeah. The wallabies, right then. Wallabies, right. right. We've got a plus one now. <laughs> Eunice has joined us. Where are you from? Uh, I'm living in Switzerland, but I'm from Germany. Ah, right. There you go. Next one for the trail. We waited till we got to the car park and there was loads of people about till we started changing. We got into our kegs and uh, uh, that girl left us then, so I don't know if it was because of that. <laughs> I'll catch up to her later, we're going quite slow today, so... These roots are mad, aren't they? Stop for a little bit of energy drink. Following the loch, going up and down a couple of really steep bits. Yeah, I keep seeing the same old faces. Quite a few different people on the same route as us. So, uh, are we going to get a camping spot at that body? We'll see. 
If not, we're just going to cram inside, I think. First proper break, really. Sat down for a chill. <laughs> oh, I'm fucking up my leg, but... There's a hell of a you that's falling down here. Ah, it's proper old. Right, stopped in the Rodenon Hotel. We're on the Pepsis. We've got a nice. <laughs> Stealing a bit of electric and getting on their Wi Fi for a minute. Oh, Why not? 10 feet. <laughs> Good. I'll look at my head all the time, huh? Feeding time at the zoo coming up. Sun's <laughs> <laughs> coming out. A lot of cool, man. It's looking good. Where, where have you got to get to? And he claims he's finished. What do you think? Another meal. Looks like he's just been served. <laughs> <laughs> Smashed it out. You had the uh, southern fried chips. chicken, jalapeno poppers. So we've done a fair old bit today. This is uh, as we come down off Condic Hill. We've come all the way along the coast. And we are... Where are we? Here. Road Denham Hotel we're in. So we just need to get... Still got a fair old way, mind. Up to you. So sad. One, two, three, four, about five kilometers. Right, we've had our meal, fish and chips. Spent 75 quid in two days. I need to slow down the spending, man. Ah, oh, look at this. Made it on cakes and stuff. Oh, they look nicer stuff in here, mind. I like to. I'm on the spend lately. Lovely now. We're on the beach again. Top of tans. Air the feet out. Take care of them tuts. You. This guy's found a mint spot right next to the beach. Have to keep going. Still looking for a campsite. A mile till the body. It's bound to be something now. It's been hard going this track. Got steep drops all the way around. Those are steps. It's good fun though. Feeling a bit green around the gills. Slow my pace right down. It's either that or I lose my lunch. There's a mountain up there, it looks insane, look at it. Take some climbing to get up there. Oh, look at this. Ah, oh, can I get it? <laughs> Goes half a time in. Yeah. Put 10 seconds on. One, <laughs> two, three, four. <laughs> Don't look oh, like he's enjoying it, does he? Keep it then, now he'll get you stuck. He's having a lovely little paddle here, he's enjoying himself here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Ah, it's uh, about 15 seconds. Camp's all set up. Found this nice little spot just right for three. Put some gel crazy. Oh, it looks really good, it does. Doesn't it? Yeah. And I whacked some wine. Ten meals. Yeah. Nice. It's looking better than mine. I think I put a little bit too much water in it. I'm going to have to simmer it again now. Whole pork. No, I can't go wrong with that. They are nice, man. Banging. Minced beef hot pot, 
soup. <laughs> I'm going to have to put it in here to simmer it, aren't I? I haven't even tried this yet and I can tell you I'm not going to buy this again. It's literally just mashed potatoes. Some of the smallest meatballs you've ever seen in your life. A tiny bit of edge. Chocomocha. Drew's putting some pictures up on Instagram. Don't check his Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> This is unbelievable scenes. Some speed to that. Right, here's the camp. I was so knackered I jumped into bed and realised I didn't even get it on the camera. Both the boys are watching Colin Russell attempting the West Side and we separately <laughs> syncing the videos together. And they're watching it separately. I think we've seen the best of the sunset now. It's been amazing views. Oh, get my head down. Start all over again tomorrow. Day three. The warm fiesta day is woken the midges up. They're not crazy bad, but yeah. Although uh, bodies are a bit broken this morning, calves are very tight. It's only a ten miler today, so we just plod along. Everybody else takes we're just on the flat all the time. Hey, there's some hilly bits. Stop swearing! Stop swearing! Found the body. I think it is, anyway. You gotta do the knock every time you go in a body. Nobody yet. Can smell the fire's been on last night. All the gear, no idea. Oh, some Smirnoff ice there. Eh? The party for someone tonight. There you go, just sign the book. Oh, this is cow in lush, but you don't know boils. Look at that. Look at that now. Looks like everyone's added something to this. Save the life of a friend. Yeah, it's not all smooth sailing. What's that? This is where the old bridge was. We should go over there. <laughs> what is it really, Ann? I think it was a part of the bridge. Can't be. Maybe it's a dock or something. That's got like holes in it. See the holes there? Something screwed on the top of it.
I've had it on good authority from a lone explorer. The Inversnade Hotel gives you the squits, so I'm on the porridge of blueberries. Cooking in the beer garden, why not? Do you want the bag? I'll keep the bag. I'll Lads are having some balls for breakfast. Mm. <laughs> not like you, pot burger. <laughs> Purple Ball porridge, I got. <laughs> they tried to get some brekkie, but they're not serving, so. I'll show you some balls now. <laughs> They might have dodged a bullet. <laughs> <laughs> well, they am for breakfast, Pepsi, a fag, and sweets. <laughs> Found a bit of traffic now. Nice little cave if it's raining. Got some proper dramatic bits now. Coming up and down through these boulders. Now we're getting the views. Beautiful. This is the main path. Oh, it leads on it. Just walking past this big beast now, I'm not sure what this is. It's dramatic looking. Over. This is what we're having to deal with today. It's supposed to be the easy day. This is the kind of walking we got all day. You gotta stay on your toes. It's some hard going those little bits bare, aren't they? Yeah. Just sat down for five minutes, ended up with two ticks on my arm. Lucky I spotted them before they sunk their fangs in. I feel a bit itchy all over now. <laughs> Nearly to the end of the lock. Give me arm. <laughs> Give me what? Give me arm. Glorious sunshine down here, we're in our t-shirts. Top of that peak. Right in the distance. That's snow. Looks like a smiley face. Woohoo! Aha! This is where the Colin Russell and his crew stayed. <laughs> right, he's not getting another shot, is he? I tell you, it looks a bit nicer, mine, the sleeping platforms. Right next to the fire. He's had a food shop, don't he? We have to sign the other book now. Any more smooth off ice? Yeah. Empty bottle of wine, that's, a, that's good, isn't it? Is anybody in here? Perfect campsite, look at this. The views. We can see the pub, it's across the road, across the river. We're just hoping there's a couple of pictures in this campsite now. If not, it's a long walk back to get out of this no camping zone. Uh, I'm finding the camping spot, don't you worry about that. Being glass campsite, the tents are up. Hold up now, hold up. Who's serving here now? Well, we're going to find out now. I don't know which heads are ready because I've seen it. Is it? Yeah, heads. Hey, right. I'll serve. <coughs> you can stamp in is out the window. Now it's what this game is called. Clask. Clask. Let's be fair, can stamping's gone. Played this back in my Sweden days. It's dead now, I can stamping. We'll live the clask. Oh, roof cock. Oh, one in the old. Two down. It's going to be a whitewash. Let's see the colour. 
That was a gentle touch. Yeah, I'm trying to get him to. Uh... Yes. Oh. They feel my nuts. That's the pro version, right? Eh? You make it up as you go along, right? <laughs> yeah. oh. Oh, my yeah. You're on five in that now. That's where that's gone up since I ducked down there. That's gone <laughs> out. <laughs> oh, that's a dodgy one over there. Go that way. Oh, no. Uh oh. Ooh, Ooh, he out. Yeah. Oh, oh, is that game over? True. So when, uh, bye bye. Swallows going in and out here. Yeah. Oh, there's a three. Got a nest up in the corner, yeah. So we've hiked all of this now. So we would have started off down here somewhere. We came up, I think camped up somewhere here, and now we fight the rest of it right up the top. And one of these has got the wallabies on, I don't know which one. <laughs> The old haggis needy hunted to extinction these days, you know. Two headed sheep. That's pretty freaky up with it a bit but fancy some burger with extra cheese it's not exactly a big packet you know, it's only like that uh, long it's the last campsite yeah for the only reason that's me Yo, what are you doing, man? <laughs> Morning. Morning. Where's Lee gone? <laughs> Whoa, hey, we're getting the interesting bit. Nice, man. We're hunting Lee. We found a track. Smells like it could be. We did the hour. Yeah. Still fresh. <laughs> Going down north, is he? <laughs> Keep sipping that door. It's harder when you're holding poles and a camera. Getting treated to some epic views today. We're catching up with you, Lee. Sorry, sheepies. Stop off for breakfast now. Small porridge. He's had an energy drink. Not really tasty though, is it? The peach one is lovely. It does a job. It's looking a lot more Scottish now, I think. Been treated to the scenery today. Dun dun dun! Morning! Where's Bailo? 
Jeez. <laughs> One, two, three, four, six, coming for you. <laughs> three, four, knocking at your door. Still no sign of Lee. We're slowly plodding on. I think it's a town halfway now. Might get a couple of supplies. And then onwards to Tin Drum tonight. We're in a, a little camping pod. We charge everything up, wash our clothes. Shower, just live in luxury. It's a lovely little forest now. How to identify trees from a long way away. Number 14. The larch. The larch. Come in for a little look at this graveyard. Um, it's on like a big burial mound. And they found markings on some of the rocks from the 7th or the 8th century. There's not even any church nearby or anything. It's a weird one. Ah, okay. So there's a graveyard and this is an old ruined church next to it, look. Been to Strathfillion wigwams, a can of coke, banana, and some fudge. Lee's already in the pub, he said, but we're not far off now. A legend of the lost sword. Could it be in this loch? All these Zen rocks here. I have to add one to the top of this now. Pat Sharp is back in business. Syndrome in. <laughs> um, what the hell? Like, keep your finger there. Forward back out. Here we are. We're staying in Nevis. Hey, oh, oi, oi, oi. Ben Davis, Ben. Woo! My pink towel. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you're going to be mad to carry your pink towel. You're going on the bottom, boys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, me. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, we got a microwave, man. Could have cooked a microwave me meal up here. Got a fridge. Do you want to be a walker? Like <laughs> Yeah. Spag ball in the posh shed. I am absolutely blitzed. <laughs> I could easily go to sleep. It's about five o'clock. <laughs> These two boys are fresh. <laughs> I wouldn't say fresh. <laughs> So, yesterday we came from Bing Glass Farm. We just followed this river. Gave a lot more nice views than what I was uh, hoping to expect. Came through this lovely little forest. Look at the forest. <laughs> That's a better point, actually. Over here. In the Tindrum. It's nicer than the map makes out, you know, it looks like you run next to the road and stuff. I did enjoy that yesterday. Yeah, I enjoyed it. And today we've got a big day. Oh, yes. Past some old, big old beasts. All these have overtaken us already. At least 15 or 20. <laughs> Always picking up the pace yet. Well, to be fair, they're all day packers, so... There's a big mama up here. It's on the same height as Snowdon. What a big beast. It's 
my enemies, but uh, they're off the pass today, so I might. You've got a plastic bit with two white patches on the side. Andrew made this. What's the two white patches? We're getting treated some wide open vistas today. Feeling very sleepy now. Craving a bit of breakfast. I could do with uh, coffee and orange juice, I think. Bacon and egg roll. We're walking in the Bridge of Oakey. I got a feeling it's just going to be four houses there or something. Fingers crossed for the burger van. Looking like a boy. <laughs> Bridge of Orkey. Come on, bring on the cafe. I don't hold out much hope at the moment. We can the bar and watch him uh, waddle down the steps. Eh? Ah, oh, look at him giving it the big one. <laughs> he coming up. Right on. Yeah. There's something now. Morning. Biggest bacon rolls in there. Let's hope. Bridge of Alky. Don't bother, I couldn't get served. Went to the bar, she said he'd go wait at the table. And the guy just ignored us and walked back and forth ten times. Go somewhere else. Take a business elsewhere. Lost Lee. Yeah. Bit of a climb was like 300 meters, and uh, we got a bit of a turn of speed on, anyway. Yeah, we Feeling quite fit now. First into little jogs, huh? Ah, look at it! Wild, wild west. Absolutely stunning. The views just keep getting better and better. This is amazing. Snow at the top of that one. Stopped here for a bit of snacks. Feel like we're about to get wet, so got the old trousers on. Rain is proper in now. This is the Scotland we all know and love. Nice looking house, huh? And we need to press on. I was commissioned in 1803 to build new roads. Yeah, pretty cool. You are in. Well, this is his road then. Just had another little tick just in between the fingers there. Uh, feels like he's bitten me because uh, and feels a bit funny, you know. Third one of that, they, they rolled me on my arms. Huge, huge landscapes. Getting breezy down here. We might have to pitch up in the woods tonight, we'll see how it goes.
I think Drew first stopped for a break for 10 minutes. He's been chasing Lee for the last hour. We think he's trying to beat us the pub. He's shown his competitive side, yeah? The boy's got heart. But there he is. We nearly got him. You can smell this scent. He's getting very close. He'll sneak on by. Covered in snow. The plan is spread out. He's just ahead, Struth is just behind. All I have to scramble to get our coats on again. Trousers are getting a bit soaked because I should have got my waterproof trousers on as well. Glencoe Ski Resort. A little bit of snow on the top, even though it's me. And um, we're looking for the King's House Hotel now. Hopefully, he's going to be somewhere to camp nearby. Glen Court. What's this for it, lads? Well done. Thanks so much. This is the peace run. The world's largest run for peace. And uh, we came over two days ago from Ireland. Ah, right. Um, uh, we're running from Fort William the whole way down. We'll reach uh, Glasgow tomorrow evening and then on to Edinburgh. Oh. On to the Netherlands. Good well done. Again. Good luck to you. All the best. <laughs> Try again. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we're about the best view in the house. Yeah. Oh. There's a deer just chilling out in the hotel car park, yeah? Just don't give a stuff, man. He's examining the damage over on Blood Gang right below. Yeah, there's uh, about 15 ducks gang rape and a female duck down there just now. And he's probably sniffing like, what the hell's gone down yet? <laughs> <laughs> well, 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 look what I just pulled out of my leg. Perfect pass. Yeah, we scanna. Hold it off his willy. <laughs> <laughs> Gross, man. It's mad looking what he did, but yeah. It's just like a massive pipe. Where we go? Uh, Cook this heavy pipe. Got a hole in this. Got a hole in the middle. There's a piano by here, but all I know is still Dre. I better not bring them shoes down. <laughs> yeah, I did learn that. Yeah. He's a big boy, isn't he? Jeez. I want to meet him on the trail. <laughs> you and your rights. I tell you, that's an interesting book. Footpath. When was it written? I don't know. Within 1700? Laws have changed. Could be. <laughs> Nineteen eighteen. <laughs> okay, it's a few years out of date, but fines might have gone up slightly. The mad one I saw was like taking eggs out of a nest, fifty quid per egg, which is nothing, is it? This is Lee's new Z pack. Which model is this now? Altaplex. The Altaplex. Four skins. The ones I've seen, they've just been Velcro. That's a bit better, I suppose. Nice, plenty of room. Nifty little spot. There's me. There's Lee. There's the pub. Unbelievable spot. All the facilities. On the cost. What's in this little uh, titbit? Chicken tikka masala. Oh, that's what I got, man. Basically, chicken tikka with rice. What do we think of Lee's campsite here? It's basically cheating when they're going to bring a pint to the campsite, isn't it? 
I don't know. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Drew for living it up with his real tour mat. And I got my expedition foods. Here's our neighbours. Now. Apparently, there's beer and Wi Fi at this wild campsite. <laughs> <laughs> Where's Lee? Yeah, I think you get the gist of this trip. 6.45, nearly packed. Lee does seem keen on being on his own for this trip. Oh well. Um, truth is just packing up now. I may as well cook up my breakfast, I think. Hang about for him, may as well, no? Today's brekkie. <coughs> Right, Tindrum to King's House. Started here, on the campsite. And we went past some big mountains then. Bean Odraf, uh, Bean Odha, Bean Dorain, past Bridge of Orkey. Don't bother with the hotel there. We found this one instead, much better. Nice little shop, sandwiches, coffees, uh, rain kicked in about a year, and Lee overtook us somewhere here, and we spent the next hour chasing him down. Um, caught him on when we were going up the hill. Came round to Glencoe Mountain, across the road, and we stayed at King's House there, just across the bridge. Quite a the trail down there. Glencore, you are a stunner. Rough one this morning. Headed for Devil Staircase. Going up to about 500 odd metres, I think. It'll be dropping down the other side then. Heading towards Ben Nevis. Let's just keep getting bigger or what? There he is, man. Drop more door. Get that door in, you boys. It's devil staircase. That's not too hard so far. I don't know if it's going to get steeper or what. We just came across Lee. He's explained that uh, he's in some severe pain and uh, he's going to try to get the next town and assess his, his next choice, his next move. We've got 29k today, Ben Nevis tomorrow. If I was him, I can't tell him what to do, but if I was him, I'd solo camp halfway tonight, 15k. And then at least he can finish the trail tomorrow, huh? another 15k. Keeps getting steeper and steeper, doesn't it? Oh. I'm guessing that's a megalithic rock. Looks a bit too well placed, doesn't it? Over to the other side of the hill now. Ben 
this somewhere in the distance up the clouds. Coming down the arse end of the devil staircase. That was 10, we're going about three hours. Chucking down rain. So I'm staying nice and dry anyway. This bit here, they burnt all this. It looks really fresh and new. Passing these huge hydroelectric power pipes. Shoot the water down the hill as fast as they can. Spin the turbine, make electric. <laughs> I think, is it gonna blow? The water coming out of the power plant. Wow. Dumped a few extra tons of water in the river there, haven't they? Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Shows we're nearly there. Anyone know what this beautiful looking plant is? It smells exactly like pea. Like pea. Another little technical bit after Kinloch Levin. We've had a message from Lee saying that he's going to make it to Fort William no matter what happens. Whether it takes him one day or two days, so that's good. I'm glad he's not trying to, to back out. <laughs> but you might not do Ben Nevis tomorrow, so it could just be us two doing that. We'll see. We're going to do a time check here, starting 12.27. See how long it takes us to get to the bottom there now. Time check, all the way down here, 12.55. 28 minutes, and look what's ahead. <laughs> Same again. <laughs> oh, we'll get there in the end. Please keep out. I am bored of this track, of this track, of this track. Oh my god, it goes on forever. They don't tell you about this, do they? The boring bit. Well, I think we're on the final valley now. Should be heading towards the forests and I'm pitching one of them tonight. We think we might have the first glimpse of Ben Nevis there. Our campsite is just before it. Oh, when we find one, hopefully it is. Uh oh, <laughs> it goes up higher than I thought. <laughs> There's apparently remains of an old fort on there. I'm going to try attacking that, would you? That was an idea for a potential campsite tonight. I'll have a think about this now. Well, there's tomorrow's challenge. You can see the path going up the side there. <laughs> Set up at last in the woods. We've had to just chuck the tents up and dive inside because there's uh, midges everywhere. <sighs> Shat there today. That was a long one. Don't know Lee, how far Lee is going to get, but you know, hopefully he meets us by tomorrow now. I've got one more meal. I feel like I want it now. We might have to go to the youth hostel, mind, for another meal. Starving. Yeah, well, if I don't fall asleep. Look at this wee scanner. Oh my god. That is a serious size tick. I'm lucky he's out on the outside of this. I'll check my legs and stuff now. This is the state you get in when you're trying to organise your tent. But you don't open the door for the midges and ticks. K 
King's Osterbear Nervous. We came up here, followed this route to the Dell Staircase. And this was a big day, as you'll see. So um, this felt quite long to get back down. It started getting quite chilly up here. We came down into Kinloch Levin. Oh, and I, I didn't realise it's two different towns. Kinloch Moor, Kinloch Levin. Bought a couple of things in the co-op. Resupplied. Uh, we walked up through the woods. This was the most boring section of the route. When we got to these trees, it got a little bit more interesting. Now they have chopped down a lot of this. Came all the way around, all the way around. And we camped, we walked up this little path there, a tiny bit, ready to smash Bear Nevis tomorrow. Just to warn you, I'm about to show you my feet. They're not too bad, but what the hell is going on with that? Looks like you're full of potholes. Blister starting there. <sighs> Not too bad otherwise, really. It was pointless hanging these socks up to dry, wasn't it? Ah, uh, nice. Yeah, I've had two look, jacks. look who's crawling about on my jacket. Half six, chocolate mocha for Bracky. Breakfast. Breakfast. <laughs> then we'll be hitting the slopes. Little forest location served as well. Been plenty of bugs, we've just hidden the tent the whole time. 1300 meter climb, coming up. Come on. Just for the tap outside this restaurant, we open this fresh water. That's us for the trip, I think. Head in this way now. A lot of people do bear nervous. Who brings all their kit though? Tent and sleeping bag the lot. You gotta push it one more. Coming up to 600 meters, weather's starting to cool down. We're just about to hit the clouds. Someone's told me the top is above the clouds. So, hoping for some epic views now. Cruise ship coming into Fort William. Be a decent place to camp at that lock there. Peach energy drink. Not sponsored by Real Tourmat, but if you want to, I'll be happy. If we come above the clouds. Found the snow. Very surprised to see that in the middle of May. Truth has burned me off now. He loves flying up a mountain. I'm just taking it slow. I'm going. Not far off the top of Ben Nevis, no. There was a couple arguing behind me just now. And she goes, You don't even touch my feet anymore. And he said, Aye, well, there's a time and a place. <laughs> Halfway up the mountain. <laughs> Us in the glass here now. I think you're best off picking your own route. <laughs> there it is. The Buddhist temple. There's a monk up here, he'll tell you fortune. If you pay him uh, in blood money, 
the snow hanging over the edge there. Check out the hut then. Renevis! First time I've mentioned this on this trip, but I bought this on day one, intended to take it to the body. I've carried it 100 miles. <laughs> We're sitting on Ben Nevis. She has. <laughs> For the drop? Yeah. Highest drunk man in the UK. <laughs> well, hardly drunk, like. <laughs> Whoa. We fall it off a month and I'm on top of the world, Ma. I'm on top of the world. The depth of the snow. In the middle of me. Uh, Weird. Chock a marker, he's got. <laughs> Up now, Sam. Jesus. Flying back down the hill now. Head to the hostel, get some dinner in us. Beer. Well, I've had a whiskey. So. I can't really complain if you're having a beer, can You can tell the true Celts because we're in our t-shirts. It's time for a Lee update. <laughs> so, he was struggling yesterday and we were saying to him, cut it into two days instead of doing one long day because he wasn't going to do Ben Nevis. So, I think he's come a long way yesterday. Um, now, instead of meeting us at the hostel tonight, he decided to go the extra two kilometers into town and he said he's going to book a hotel or get a train back. Um, I don't know, he knew we were staying in that hostel so I'm not sure why he wants to do that but that's up to him. Finishing up at the Ben Nevis Inn. Cheers. <laughs> Come on. Cheers. <laughs> oh my god. I need the This is where we camped last night. Yeah. Came up the mountain track. <sighs> zigzagged all the way up. Uh? In the snow. I'm just talking with the camera. Uh, 1345. Yeah, covered in snow. I was surprised at that. Back down. Uh, we went to Ben Nevis in for one. Come back and we're at the hostel tonight. There. <laughs> Dirty fries, man. Best food I've seen on the trail so far. Glen Nevis restaurant. Good value. Big portions. Home stretch, two miles to go. Got a massive banana for the trip. <laughs> Think that's my answer, <laughs> I'm just going to wave her at all the cars I see, huh? 
Yeah, I got treated to a sing song by the uh, Switzerland boys. Had a bit more energy than I'm used to in the morning. As you can see, I'm not looking too fresh this morning, but we did have a bit of a party last night. Could be that. Let's get the fort, will you, man? Oi, oi. King's House. Yeah, King, King's House yeah, Hotel. Yeah, that was really good, that was. It all worked well. I didn't use a few things. Um, my down trousers. We could have, could have left them in the house. Yeah. We had them packed up the treat. Um, top 10 worked, uh, worked really well. Yeah, I was happy. The hardest part for me was probably the second leg of the Loch Lomond. Yeah. Climbing over the rocks and stuff like that. That was quite hard going. Kinloch leaving out. Yeah. Absolutely wrecked my feet. Um, best bit, same as you, that, that farm, uh, the my glass. Yeah, my glass campsite. That was fab seeing everybody. Good food, beer. Um, everything worked. All my kit worked absolutely well. Nothing. Like, well, like, say, I say all Except my kit worked shoes. well. Except for my trail runners, yeah. the ultra low peak fives, way, way, way too thin for that kind of terrain. I think. Shame I didn't do Ben Nevis, but anyway, it'll always be there. When I do yeah. the next time, wait, wait. still tapped out, still not tapped out, still got to the end and tapped the old man on his head. So I was happy with that. Yeah. Really enjoyed. It. Oh, and the uh, and the hotel in Glasgow was fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well enjoyed. Good effort from everybody. Yeah. Right, thanks for watching. Don't know when the next adventure is going to be. Not for a while. Let my feet recover. Right? Shout out to these. Ta da! I think we're going to have a good sunset. I'm just going to low. It's L O M. L O M. Yeah. N D. O N D. O N D. L L O M. <laughs> o N D. O N D. O N D. Yeah. Roman. Yeah. L O M. <laughs> Fucking hell, man. L O M. Do a video, yeah. Yeah, go on. L O M. <laughs> L O M. O N D. O N D. Loch Lomond. Lomond. All oh, right. <laughs>